Our confidential informant isn't the only one with stories of alleged problematic behavior involving Officer Chip Campbell. From our office in New York, we talk with former Chillicothe drug dealer Ronald Woolham in an interview via the prison's video visitation system. Do you know of any police corruption that Chip Campbell might have taken part in? Absolutely. <laughs> she actually approached Chip at a gas station and uh, propositioned him for sex and didn't know that he was a cop. And uh, he had took her behind the strip mall and uh, called Twyla to come and search her and told her, was like, look, you're going to work for us and uh, we're going to protect you and we're going to make sure you keep your kids. And if you don't, well, we'll just make sure you never see your kids again. Do you know which girls were actually working with Chip or Twyla? No, the only one I really know for sure was Tamika. Pretty much public knowledge that Tamika was an informant. I'd say at least five of them girls worked, you know, directly with Chip Campbell. What was Chip Campbell and Twyla Goble's relationship with Dollar Bill, if you know? I knew they was working together just by, you know, different girls come up to me and say, look, I've seen, you know, Dollar Bill up there in Chip's office. And uh, Dollar Bill, from what I understand, said, well, yeah, that's why we've been getting away with so much for so long. So I figured Dollar was informant from day one. Two sources have come forward with allegations that Dollar Bill was working as an informant for Officer Chip Campbell. If these allegations are true, it would be ironic that someone who may have been killing these women because they were informants may have been an informant himself.